we're doing a walk today up West Nab um, on the eastern edge of Saddleworth Moor above Meltham. Just a little stroll. I've got your eyes at with me. We're not going so far. Uh, it's a lot brighter over this side. I've just come up through Greenfield and over Saddleworth Moor, and it's thick with fog up there. Uh, but yeah, it's clear over here. Um, I'll just give you a, a look at the at the surrounding scenes. A lot of grouse chuckling on the moor. I can hear one or two other sort of birds, don't know what they might be. Um, but yeah, I've got my binoculars, so we'll see if there's anything around. I get lucky with a short-eared owl or something. I've seen them up here before. Anyway, um, I'll just show you the area, get a feel for the place. See you near the top. We're going. West Nab's just the skyline up there. There's our eyes at waiting patiently. There's some of the rocks on the edge. There is the cock crowing stone. Probably named because grouse pitch on it, crowing like cockerels. There's Meltham down there. Where we saw my cousin lives. A car. And looking back up the road that we've just come down. Walk ahead. The riser on his way up. Just heard some golden plover on the top as well. I hope I see them. Red grouse on the edge there. I haven't got my big telephoto lens, so I'm not going to get any detail. Can hear the golden plover somewhere. Oh, there's a flock up there. Somewhere around there. Don't know how they got them on film. Oh, a lot. 25, 30. There's the grouse. Where's Isaac? There he is. Saying hello. There's a trig point and Isaac. Yeah. Through near the top, the golden plover just whizzing about. Again, I'm not sure if you're picking them up. Great little hill, West Nab. Take close to the road. Just need a bit of a a moorland fix. Park down there, bomb up here. It's good, I like it. And in no time, you're over 500 metres. Nice uh, flutings and things on that rock. Look at that. Good place of ring oozles up here as well. Well, not this time of year, but I've seen them in spring. Loads of red grouse. There's the grouse a little bit closer. Could be anything though, couldn't it? Could be a chicken. A bit slow to focus when I use the DSLR. There's our Isaac. There's that little cot, a little ruinous hut. Probably for shepherds or something. Shooters, keepers, whatever. Hello! Yeah. At the top. The summit. There's our Isaac. Nice big blocks of grit stone up here. Just a little sunny beam over there. I think that's over in the uh, Slowit, above Slowit. Looking on the moor that leads to Shooter's Nab. It's an aircraft uh, wreckage over here. I didn't know about it when I found it, but I stumbled upon it once. YouTube world. And then I think that's Raven Rocks over there. Yes, on the summit rocks just west of the trig point. I call this the compass stone. You can see carved into the rock are a couple of um, concentric circles with the points of the compass on. It looks very worn, so I reckon it's old. I don't know, 1800s maybe. Um, but I've been up here a lot as a teenager. Um, with a pal of mine, and I never remember seeing this then. But it's just something I've noticed in the past few years. I've been coming up with the kids, and the compass uh, looks pretty accurate. South certainly that way, ish. There you go. My water on again. I'm gonna have something hot. Quicker line it this time. Must be getting better. Again, the moor's very, very wet. I've got water at hand. 
being extra careful. Right, the mist's really come down now. I've only just got my dinner on. It's took ages to boil. Don't know why. It is uh, very cold and very damp though, maybe that, that affected things. I'll just turn the camera around and then you can see what I'm on about in terms of the mist. It's really dropped. Uh, no views now. You alright Isaac? There's me uh, stuff for my dinner. Super noodles and a cup of tea. Highly nutritious, I don't think. Almost back at the car. Just a little uh, stroll to the top of an hill really. Made some dinner, had a bit of a picnic with our Isaac. Just needed a bit of fresh air. My legs are sore though, I did a run yesterday. First run I'd done for a couple of years really. I could really feel my legs stiff. Muscles aching that I didn't even know I had. Anyway, that's all for now. I'll see you on the next Mommy. one. Say bye. Goodbye YouTube world.